Do you think you could beat Parks and Pines in a fight? Hello! From Blackpool. Our favourite place. We're back again. This is how many weeks in a row has our vlog been from Blackpool? Many, Four. many weeks, yeah. Yeah. We stayed over at this travel lodge last night. It's the one next to the football stadium. Um, it was nice and cheap and yeah. it was alright. It was alright inside, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, and so we stayed over last night because we went to Bongo's Bingo and that was fun and then we went on the night out and we got very 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 drunk if you haven't already check out last week's video because we captured it all we took you with us <laughs> but today we're feeling a bit rough but we're gonna power through because we've got a nice day planned really nice day we're doing the mailing attractions but for the first time we're doing afternoon tea at blackpool tower and it so looks cute. really nice i've never done blackpool tower so weird we literally come blackpool like every weekend i've never done it. i've done it as a little kid but never as an adult we've tried haven't we yeah if you're not watched already last this time last year we did um we drank our way through mail and attractions and just got drunk all day um it was too windy to go yeah. to the tower wasn't it it was so we didn't do it so we're gonna go to the tower today we went that's actually where bongo's bingo was last night so it's gonna be interesting to see it in a different yeah last light. night the floor was fully covered they had a massive floor covering down um and like so you couldn't get the full effect obviously yeah. to protect it so it'd be nice to see it today like clean and lit and yeah. Dance. yeah, it said there's going to be like live music, you can have a dance if you want and I think it was £15, pound, wasn't with it, with Berlin, Berlin. Yeah. and we're not alone, we're going to be meeting the girlies again, we're going, we're, we're all about the lift hills, are up north, Yeah. We, so we're going to meet up with them again and yeah, do the mill attractions, we're doing the dungeons, we're doing Mad and Two Swords, we're doing, we might even do a bit of Passage, we're doing a bit of everything, Ooh. so come along with us, <laughs> woo! We've made a quick pit stop at Lindell Cafe. Lindell Cafe. Abby's gone for hash browns and a fried egg sandwich. She's very happy about it. And a brew. I've got a brew and a sausage sandwich. So we're here. It's time for our first attraction of the day. It is Madame Two Swords. Not been here yet this year. No? Who do you want to see? Um, Ollie uh, Brian Cox? Yeah, we love him. Visit Brian What's his name that I like? Hi, Grills. No, I'll work. <laughs> What's his face? Oh, John Bishop. The highlight for us is always the road to return. We're going to go and stop. Yeah. I hope the quiz is on and I hope we win. Yeah. That is insane how real they look. This girl is. My biggest feeling here, and I've said this in a vlog before, is that we're on my aunt and dad's Saturday night takeaway and they're going to be like, yeah, they're going to start moving. So we've just come in. They've given us a little leaflet on Merlin offers yeah, on today. Yeah, they've got a pass. So, brochures are two pounds. Wax hand, fifty percent off. If you want to get someone, give someone your hand. Keeping a magnet for fiver. That's not bad at all. Not really, is two pound fifty each. Yeah, cute. I might get my hand. Give it to someone as a gift. Nice. Here's my hand. Hello. <laughs> Please welcome to the stage, Abby from Parts and Finds. Woo! Do you actually use head and shoulders? Did you like my dancing? Oh, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be having that, mate. Ask if she ever watched Parks and Pines. Have you ever watched Parks and Pines on YouTube? Have you always dreamed of having She's very weird, that one. Is it, yeah? Good. He is quite good, you know? Oh, I'm scared that the real light here. He looks so weird. He's definitely not. Definitely John not. Bishop is not in Blackpool on Saturday morning. You don't think? No. Oh mate, but it does look He's real. Got things to do than be on Saturday morning. <laughs> it does. She looks real as well. I'm gonna catch one of them blinking. So we've just been looking at the smallest and um, celebrity winners, and we can't for life think who won last year. We don't remember a single person who was in it. Mm -hmm. Right, pause the video and comment if you remember who won last year. Because this is like Mandela effect, something like that. Like, no, it wasn't on last year. I don't think it was. <laughs> it must have been. If you know, comment. No cheating. Boom. <laughs> Try to catch him out. Next year, the next call, clamshells 2023. <laughs> well, well, well. Look who it is. Are we rough? I think they're in the 
there we go. Uh, Abby's favourite bit. It's Coronation Street, Rover's return time. I knew I loved you the second that you just ordered a pint <laughs> at 12 when we just got in from a night out at 3 last night. It would be really rude of me not to do the same. You get him on. Oh my god. <laughs> this is mine. What's going on here then? It's a, a shame. It's shame. We've broken all of our life, Dills. <laughs> There's no point in Adele's career if she looked like that. Who is this then? So just a little update, like the bit after the music section's all shut off, so they must be doing some updates. We've noticed people have been about, like Cheryl Cole's moved, she's in a different section, and even like the mirror maze is shut, so yeah, they well, must be doing some updates. Mm. No, maybe he might still have to be to come. Do you think you could beat Parks and Pines in a fight? <laughs> Shout out DG95. Powerade. Got a brand new section called A-List Party. Um, what does that say? Lick me till what? Um, weird. weird words. Lick me till. Oh, it's got all there. That's sick. That really does look like him. <laughs> We're one attraction down. We're now about to enter the Blackpool Dungeons. Yeah. Scared. I'm looking forward to it. Very excited. It's the first time the girlies have done this. We've only done it once, twice. Was she in jail for then? <laughs> <laughs> for leaving that pint in the rovers. <laughs> so we've just got out of the dungeons and that was fab. Excellent. So so good. We had like a, quite a small group, didn't we? And it was it was really good. Yeah. yeah. Tower never fails to get us. Absolutely, it doesn't look big, but it really does like pack a punch, doesn't it? Uh, the apps are all great. I got picked on. I got locked in a cage in the torture scene. Um, you had a nice little sit down, really. I did, yeah, I did. I had a little seat. Um, yeah, very jumper, very good. Actors gave it beans. Yeah. We loved it. The sets in there are really cool. Yeah. I would recommend doing that, even if you don't have a Merlin pass. I think that one is definitely worth the money. Yeah. I think if you're gonna do one of like Sea Life. Madame Two Swords, the dungeons. I'd, I would personally go for the dungeons. Quite a long experience. Yeah, it feels like you get your money's worth. Yeah, for sure. Um, but of course, if you've got a mailing pass, it's free. Woo! And they're quite flexible as well. I don't know whether it's quite quite quiet, but we we did pre-book, but we were late, and we just went and we just scanned our pass, and they just let us in. Um, so yeah, they're not very strict on the pre-book in there. But yeah, thumb, big thumbs up from us for the dungeons. Did you enjoy your first dungeon? Uh, it's really good. Very nice. Ten out of ten all round from us. So we're on to our next attraction today, and we're at Blackpool Tower. I forgot what it was called. <laughs> Blackpool Tower, and they've got a little um, 4D cinema. So here we are. Yeah, we're ready classy. to see Nigel. <laughs> we had to queue in where, but yeah, a bit of a queue to get in. It looks worse than it is, so the queue looks massive, but it's just because people are having the fun. So we um, had a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Today. A lot of laughs. But very excited! It's hot though. So, this is what it looks like inside the 4D cinema. Excited to see Nigel? Yes. Did I have the worst seat in the house for that show? <laughs> right under the sprinkler. Kept going, bloody hell, bloody hell. But then we swapped and then you yeah, guys did take some of it, yeah. Do you like that? Yeah. I've seen that a few times. It's, it's alright, innit? Random song choice, but cute. I got goosebumps, I thought it was well now. And here we go, Blackpool Tower. Wow. 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 They could have easily made this one set quick for a one second, but someone purposefully wanted it to take 69 seconds. I'm not sure about that. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Hello. 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 What a view! Stunning. And such a lovely sunny day as well. Beautiful. That's so so cool. And it, they decorated it so lovely in here with all the, the little plants and stuff. So cute. <laughs> there she is. The 4D cinema was basically like an overview of black crew, like a road black to light was cute. And then they showed the big one, we were like, wait, <laughs> like little nerds. A little bit windy for you, isn't it? 
What is it? Oh my. Oh, what a beautiful sight, and here we have the trilogy. That is the night when we went to our site. Look, it's not focusing. Oh. It is the promise. Oh, there we go, oh, there she is. Is that the Leighton Rakes rooftop bar? Do you remember when we were talking about this? Look at us, we're at the top of Blackpool Tower and we're pointing out everywhere we've ever been for a drink. In <laughs> so, yeah, you can walk up. Um, extra couple of flights of stairs and actually like be in the open air which is really nice and refreshing considering how boiling it is yeah, everywhere so else right now here. yeah it's really nice it's a lovely day this is very different to bongo's bingo afternoon tea in the Blackpool Tower ballroom and I would say that's my favourite fifteen pound I've spent in a very long time. Yeah. yeah. Incredible. So cute, so wholesome. Not something you expect to do every day. Yeah. But... Hey. <laughs> not your normal Saturday but the food was nice. We took some out as well so it's not gone to waste. Got some dancing done. We did. Yeah. So like there's people who are like professionals and people who do it as a hobby and stuff and like they're all on the they write gear and the shoes and so we were like watching them for ages and they're like, everyone get up. So I'm my bloody dogs. Yeah. We converse stomping on the dogs. Around. And we were we were stomping around the taught us how to do it. We did it. we had a little dance, we learned them. So it's stressful having people watching and we're like <laughs> Nicole's like wrong foot. We're doing the wrong feet. <laughs> And like this cute little man was like, I'll film for you. So he's following us around like with the camera. We were like, oh my God. But it was cute. We learned how to waltz. Yeah. And yeah, we, it was, it was good. we were living our best Strictly life there. Yeah. I wish we captured the moment the man on the world, it so just came up from under the stage. Insane. It rose Something up. Something like a vampire. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it reminded me of vampire. It was so good. Very wholesome. Would recommend. Not for everyone, but I loved it. Yeah, I'm sure we'll do it. Yeah, definitely. We're, me and Abby are going to get the shoes. We're going to come every Saturday. Or you will be cutting about that floor. <laughs> See us on Strictly 2023. This one? Oh. <laughs> yeah, she thinks I'm not going to be ready till next year. <laughs> we're, no, we're coming this year. Look at the weather out here. <laughs> Costa del Blackpool. It really is. Had a little wander around Coral Island. These did the girls train for the first time. Yeah. Did you like it? Yeah. Not it's bad cute. for two pounds. Yeah. Not yeah. bad. But now the mood in camp is quite low because we, we regret our decisions. <laughs> we have yeah. trekked over to the other side. We're outside Pleasure Beach now. Here is Grand Nash. Um, we've decided to do passage, and we're, every single one of us are terrified. We've never done it before, so yeah, petrified. <laughs> we have done it before, and we're petrified. <laughs> so. Right, it's time, it's time, it's time. We are so very scared. Um, I'd say the best chip in general. No. It's our okay, but he's not in there. He's out here. Here we go. Are you scared? No, I'm not. You're well hard. Are you scared? 
yeah, so. <laughs> We're training for spooky season, we've got a girl at ourselves. We're back in. Yeah, this is our prep for Rio City. The waiting, the anticipation. Okay. We've just come out. What? The yeah, hell? Scary. Brilliant. My heart's pounding. I think that I that was the most scared I've ever been in my entire life. It doesn't get easier, does no. it? No. I know your hand. You were holding my hand, and you're getting so like sweaty. Yeah. And, oh, oh, God. God. I was absolutely sweating today. And I think that's the loudest I've screamed as well. Yeah, there was yeah. one jump scare that really, yeah. really, really had me scream in my head. Uh, I nearly pushed the people in front of me out of the maze. Yeah. In the finale, there was three <laughs> actors in the finale bit and um, the people leading our group just stopped and watched them. And we just stood just like looking at them. And there's a big door in front of them saying exit. And I'm like, go, go, go. When she got out, I've got to apologise to them. <laughs> oh, there's a chainsaw oh. behind me and you're just chilling. Unbelievable. They are, it's so, if you've never done it, you need to do it. It's incredible. Yeah. 12 pounds, it's so worth every penny. It's brilliant. Yeah, we were in there for at least nine minutes. Yeah. Hello, so we're nearing the end of our day. We just went to the perfect shop. Just that? Making a purchase. Yeah, I'm buying a dog lead for my new little puppy. Aww. That's the end of our lovely weekend in Blackpool. Oh no, it's been ace. It's been, it's been so fab. Nice. It's been so different because normally we just come, we do Pleasure Beach, we have a pint, we go Bentleys, like, and we love that. But it's been really nice the last couple of weekends doing things that we, we've done but not done for ages or not done before. And and then something different with the ballroom dancing yeah. today, which is so, like, that's a so highlight cute. for me. And I've never been in the Tower Ballroom until yesterday. Gone twice in 24 hours for hugely different reasons. Unbelievably different. And it's been lovely spending the weekend with um, All About the Lift House as well, Abby and Lauren. Yeah. They're so lovely. We love them a lot. Um, so yeah, it's been great. Really good. Thank you for watching. If you like Blackpool content, consider subscribing to us because we never shut up about the place. <laughs> please, We're always here. please, please. See you in the next one, which will probably be a Blackpool vlog. <laughs> it might actually not be. What will it be? What else have we got? Yeah. Oh, it might not be. No, it might not be. It could be Salt Park, could be Alton Towers, could, could be, be Warwick Castle, Manor. could be Drayton Manor. Stay tuned. That means you gotta subscribe. <laughs> Bye. Bye.